morning, Miles Mafia family. I'm Drill Sergeant Miles, and this is Drill Sergeant Lawrence. And we're here in the BCT Bay, and we're going to show you how to make a bunk utilizing the hospital corners. Welcome to my channel. Make sure you like, share, and comment on all videos. And if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button. The items that we're going to be using will be one pillow, one pillowcase, two white sheets, and one green blanket. Start by grabbing one sheet, spreading it evenly across the foot of the bed. Tuck the end closest to the foot between the mattress and the box spring. Don't just bunch the sheet between the mattress and the box spring. You want to ensure it lays smoothly between the two. The part of the sheet that you tuck at the foot of the bed will be hanging along the sides of the bed. You want to tuck that under the sides of the mattress. Lift the sheet skyward with the right hand and touch the sheet by forming a knife hand with your left hand on top of the corner end of the mattress. The sheet that you have in your right hand will then be lowered to form a 45 degree angle. Once you have your 45 degree angle, you will tuck the sheets underneath the mattress. Throughout the duration of making your bunk, you want to ensure that it is free of wrinkles and that it remains tight. The main thing that you need to focus on in this video is the hospital corners. The actual bunk itself may be different according to what installation you are assigned to when you go to basic training. While in basic training, your bunk is to be inspection ready at all times. You will then take your second sheet and spread it evenly across the bunk but this time it will be at the head of the bunk, executed in the same manner as previously described. When spreading your white sheets across the head of the bunk, you want to ensure that it isn't surpassing the middle of the actual bunk. That way it doesn't cover the hospital corners that you made at the foot of the bunk. Continuously throughout this video, you're going to see me and my battle buddy knife handing the bunk to ensure that it is free of wrinkles. You will then get your green blanket and spread it evenly across the foot of the bunk. You will tuck the foot of the bunk just like we did with the first sheet and you will also form your hospital corner at the foot of the bunk. When you come to basic training, it will no longer be called a bed. You will never reference where you sleep to being called a bed. The term that we use in the military is called bunk and you probably heard me reference this many times throughout this video. If you like the information provided in these videos and you want more videos like such, please leave comments like and share also if you're new to my channel please subscribe and turn on your notifications a average trainee coming to basic training who do not know how to make their bunk spends an average 20 to 25 minutes making their bunk in the morning making your bunk too standard takes time and practice i recommend you practice at home prior to coming to basic training so you can be one step closer to success when you arrive 